Hey boys and girls, I'm going to show you how you can create a Gmail account without a phone number in 2022. So first off, we want to make sure that we have logged out of all of our devices, all of our accounts. So just press this button right here. Next, what we need to do is obviously go to Gmail. Then we need to click on use another profile. Then in the left corner, select create a profile for myself. We're just gonna create some random throwaway account. Doesn't really matter. Let me just put in some basic info and select forward. Here you can see that after you have logged out of all your, all of your accounts, it's gonna say phone number optional. But what if it doesn't say phone number optional? What if that does? What if that's the case? Well, Google does this and removes uh, the phone number being optional if they noticed very weird traffic coming from your network. So if you kept on trying to create accounts, they will not say, it won't say phone number optional, it will request a phone number. But what I did, I left my accounts relaxed. I stayed logged in, I stayed logged in, in the same Google account for three days three days and it fixed the problem. So if your phone number isn't optional, you have to make sure to stay in, logged in into one Google account for three days and then try this again. And I swear it's going to make a difference, guys. But what if it's still not optional? Well, I have a solution for that as well. Uh, you got to fill in all of this information and then I would use these two websites. Now, what this does is essentially these are digital SMS receive websites. So, guys, what you can do is you select a phone number, random phone number, click on it, then you click to copy, and when the phone number is requested of you, you just copy and paste it. Now, the issue with this, make sure your uh, code country code is also correct. May, the issue with this is that lots of people use this method. So this method is uh, not going to be very effective. You find very many phone numbers, which will be above the limit of which you can uh, use. Uh, it, they've been overly used, right? So what I suggest is going to this website instead. And here you can actually see the number of messages which have been received. So for example, look at this. I don't even know what country that is. That's how good my education is. But SMS received 819. Chances are this phone number would, is going to work. And as you can see, 38 minutes ago, somebody used it to verify their Google account. So this is how you do it, guys. Remember, first off, if your phone number isn't optional, log in to one Google account, stay logged in for three days, and then create the account the way I showed you. If your phone number isn't optional, go to either of these websites. They will both be in the description below and proceed to make your Gmail account that way. Hope it helped you out. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye.